Yeah, hello everybody. Hopefully you're all doing great today. Let me get uh, situated real quickly. But uh, as you guys can tell by the title, today we are going to open up a Brilliant Stars uh, booster box. And I am pretty excited for this. This is the newest set. It just came out, like what, maybe a little over a week ago? I'm super excited to finally crack into one of these boxes. This is one of the nicest sets they've had in a very long time. Probably the nicest set since Evolving Skies. So I'm pretty excited to open this back up, or open this up. It should be quite a bit of fun. But anyway, let's uh, go ahead and reposition the camera after we uh, crack this open. We'll uh, go ahead and bust the box open. Then we'll get the camera in a more uh, good position for viewing the packs themselves. No, you guys have not missed anything. We are just starting up. Just now cracking into this box. Super excited for this, guys. You have no idea just how excited I am to open up this set. This is like one of the nicest sets that they have ever come out with. Absolutely fantastic. There they are. We got ourselves 36 packs of... Uh, Brilliant stars super excited for this opening. So basically what we're gonna do is I'm gonna move this over here for now We're gonna reposition the camera and Then we'll have to redo the focus on it as well Let's see is that good Yeah, it seems pretty decent I think that's good right there. Let's just see if we can get the focus perfect here. There we go, that's beautiful. All right, guys. Let's crack into pack number one. Super excited for this. Uh, this set I've really, really been waiting for. Uh, let's see how the code cards are. Okay, so it's flipped that way. Good to know. One, two, three, four. There is our energy card on pack one. Executor. Choice Belt. Uh, Staravia. Staryu. Carablast. Clefairy. Cheruby. Sock. Uh, Halucha. And we got a Whimsicott V-Star to start it out. What a start! We got a V-Star already! Wow, that is amazing! What a start! That is incredible. Hold on, let me uh, adjust my lighting. I think the lighting might be a little bit too dim, but that's a great start! Fantastic first pack! Alright, there's that bad boy all sleeved up. Let's uh... Get some better lighting. Oh gosh, I'm gonna have to lower the brightness now. Actually, maybe that's not even that good. There, we'll just move that one down. There we go. That is our first hit of the day out of pack one. <laughs> pack one, we got a Whimsicott V-Star. That's amazing. Fantastic way to start things out. Yeah, I have noticed the V-Stars are not easy to get, which is pretty cool that we got one off the first. So there's a, a little Shaman pack. Shaman's a cool uh, Pokemon. That pack is all kinds of jacked up. Oh my gosh. That one looks like it's been through some stuff. Go ahead and do one, two, three, four to the front. 
we got our energy card we got double turbo energy uh, Kindler Prinplup Snorunt Nosepass Dedeen Cubchu Shinx a star reverse and a Alcremine non hollow nothing crazy out of pack two now these booster boxes are known to have like 10 to 15 good cards per box which is pretty high compared to some of the older packs there we have it a Charizard pack let's hope this Charizard pack will give us a Charizard a rainbow that would be amazing if we could get a rainbow Charizard could you guys imagine if we got the rainbow Charizard that would just be incredible there's that one two three four I do like the new energy cards as well these things look nice uh, let, let me adjust the focus just a little bit more I'm gonna kind of tweak this as I go and also there that's perfect so there's our uh, lightning energy Tropius, Roseanne's backup, Blunder Policy, Axu, uh, Impidimp, Magmar. I love this card, by the way. This card looks amazing. Ryolu, Burmy, Crawdont, and on the back, we have a non hollow muck. So, so far, one thing that's decent out of three packs. But we still have so many packs to go. There is the uh, the Arceus pack. Let's break into this one. I know, right? Under 17. It's such a weird name for a card, isn't it? Or a weird name for a Pokemon. <laughs> Little Im Impidimp or whatever it was. One, two, three, four. There's our Fighting Energy. Clang. Uh, Cynthia's Ambition. Torkoal. Galette. Chimeco, Chimchar, Minchino, Baltoy, Roseanne's Backup Reverse, and Clefable non hollow. Full Art Charizard is a good amount at the moment. It is. It's quite a bit of money at the moment. There's uh, quite a few cards that are worth a decent bit, especially like some of the, the good, like uh, Charizard and Arceus cards. Those are worth quite a decent bit at the moment. Uh, some of the trainer gallery cards are really cool looking, so I wouldn't mind uh, getting some of those. One, two, three, four. And those actually take place of the reverse, so even better if we can get some. There is the Fire Energy, uh, Printplup again, uh, Beartick, Fracture, Piplup, Turtwig, Sneasel, Clink, Spirit Bomb. We got Cynthia's Ambition Reverse, I believe for the second time, and a Lucario Hollow. I mean, that's a decent Hollow to get. Lucario is always decent. But so far, Pack 1 is still taking the cake with that uh, Whimsicott V-Star. So let's get into, I believe this is Pack number 6. I believe this is Pack number 6, if I'm not mistaken. Three, four. Okay, so this one, this is actually cool right here. This is the V-Star marker. So this is the first V-Star marker we've got. So from what I understand, these are to kind of like say that you have um, used up your V-Star move. So there's a Gabite, Roddle, Berry, Carablast, Clefairy, Cherubi, Sock, Orfish. Ooh, Mewtwo Reverse. That is so cool looking. That is such... A good card right there such a beautiful card not worth much but beautiful and we got a Zarud V there we go our first V of the day we got ourselves a Zarud I believe that V is not worth too much but still cool hey bro bro how's it going dude
Hey, Kill Clinton. How's it going, dude? Sorry, guys, haven't really been reading the chat too much since we're opening up cards. How's everybody doing? There we go. Brilliant stars. Pack number, like, what? Seven? I believe this is pack number seven. Oh, we looked at the code card. Well, I don't remember which border means what, so I think we're still fine. <laughs> I did say Turtwig. It's just the way that I say it, it kind of like flows. Lightning Energy, Staravia, Berry, Lang, Clefairy, Bidoof, Electabuzz, Halucha, uh, Buzzle, Buizel, Beazel? Collapsed Stadium Reverse, and a Heat Ran Non Hollow. So, uh, side number one on this box has been kind of rough. We only got two decent cards. So far, at least. Hopefully, the luck will turn around. Although, the, the V Star in the first pack is still pretty great. Oh, you did? Nice, bro, bro. Yeah, the V Stars are like the new, they're like the new thing. They're kind of like a V Max or a G Max. Or not G Max, like they're kind of like a GX or a V Max. Very similar. They always add like something new to take that place. We got the Psychic Energy, Torkoal, Double Turbo Energy, Grottle, Gibble, Trapinch, Cast Form, Throw, Shroomish, Double Turbo Energy Reverse, and the last one is a Grim Snarl Non Hollow. Quite unfortunate, the luck has just not met up to pack number one so far. There is another Arceus pack. Maybe this one will be the uh, Arceus card. Is it Arceus or Arceus? I hear it said differently everywhere, so... I don't know what the real way to say it is. One thing I love about these packs so far is they do open nicely. That You don't have to, like, rip them too much to get them open, which is uh, nice to see. Some of the packs for different sets are just... Unnecessarily difficult to rip open. <laughs> we got the uh, Grass Energy, Weevil, Fracture, Cafe Master, Impidimp, Staryu, Ryolu, Starly, or yeah, Starly, uh, Milsery, Gloria Reverse, and Mewtwo Non Hollow. Still a good looking card though. I do like Mewtwo. I'll probably end up uh, putting that card to the side just because it's Mewtwo, you know? Gotta save those Mewtwo cards. Alright, here we have another of the uh, Arceus packs. One of these days, we're bound to open something crazy. Like, I could not see us going through this box without at least one crazy card. We gotta have at least one. One, two, three, four to the front. There is the Water Energy, uh, Sharon's Care, Bear Tick, Collapsed Stadium, Farfetched, Execute, Grimer, Clefairy, Bidoof, Hunting Gloves, Lipard. Wow, nothing out of that one. We're having a pretty rough streak now. Another Arceus pack. One, two, three, four. Got, uh, I believe this is Dark Energy, Choice Belt, Staravia, uh, Floatzel, Magmar, Staryu, Burmy, Sock, Cherubi, a Cubchu Reverse, and a Garchomp Hollow. At least we're getting a Hollow again. And a Garchomp is a pretty cool Pokemon. Also, welcome to everybody that is uh, joining the stream to watch this. It's uh, awesome to see that there's 85 of you in here watching me open up some packs. Especially considering, you know, this isn't the main thing I do on the channel. It's always awesome to see you guys come out for these streams. One, two, three, four. 
We got the Psychic Energy, Roseanne's Backup, Blunder Policy, Executor, Minchino, Carablast, uh, Beazel, Alucha, Throw, Blunder Policy Reverse again, and Wormadam Non Hollow. It's looking pretty rough, guys. It's looking pretty rough. We only have two hits now. I'm telling you, the right side of this box has to be loaded because we've been on the left side only. Uh, there's only like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs left on the left side. We got to be hitting some gold soon. We got to hit some gold soon. One, two, three, four, and that is the uh, the V Star marker. We got another V Star marker finally. A uh, Sinchino, Cleansing Gloves, Floatzel, Cub Chew, Dadeen, Farfetched, Duskull, Grimer, a Starmie Reverse, and a Flygon Non Hollow. Feels bad. <laughs> Feels bad, man. It's not looking too good so far. One, two, three, four. We got the Steel Energy, Ferdic, or is that normal? I think that's Steel. Fracture, Tropius, Duskull, Grimer, Shinx, Bidoof, Halucha, a Lypert Reverse, and a Kling Clang non hollow Definitely having some rough luck to uh, start out. I'm telling you, like, I, I think the right side has to be loaded. This is, uh, this is all we have left for the left side. We have five packs left on that side. Let's see if we can pull something crazy out of one of these. Really hoping we can turn this around. One, two, three, four. We got the Grass Energy, Grottle, Printplup, Monferno, Nosepass, Milsery, Cub Chew, Dadeen, Farfetched, Corfish, Reverse, and. Ooh, Charizard V! Let's go! We got a Charizard card. That is beautiful. That is gorgeous. Is this the alt art? Wait a second. Hold on. It's got the pattern on it. I think this is the alt art. I'm not too familiar with it. I think this is the alt art. Um, Could somebody in chat confirm? Is that the alt art one? It is? Or wait, hold on. Is it? It's got the like pattern on it. Uh, the normal Vs don't, I think. Oh. 100%. <laughs> I think that's the alt art. Oh my gosh. That's the alt art. Oh my gosh. What a pull. Charizard V alternate artwork. It's a $180 card. Oh my gosh. Really? It's a $180 card. Are you kidding me? Uh, well, that's going in a hard sleeve immediately. Let me uh, go grab my card savers. <laughs> There's absolutely no way we pulled that. That's crazy. Oh my gosh. Well, <laughs> time to sleep that bad boy up immediately. I can't believe that. I can't believe we pulled that. Uh, a little off-centered in this in the hard sleeve, but that's incredible. We got ourselves the alternate artwork Charizard V. That is a crazy pull right there. That is a crazy pull. You know, I had a feeling we were going to get something good eventually with how slow it started out. 
That's only our third good hit, and oh my gosh, it was a crazy one. Charizard V alternate artwork. Let's keep that streak going with something else crazy. Let's continue to get the crazy pulls. One, two, three, four. Can we go two for two? Let's go two in a row. We got the Lightning Energy, Friends in Galar, Probo Pass, uh, Team Yells, Cheer, Magmar, Star You, Burmy, Sock, Chimchar. Oh, Hound Dude or Hound Doom Trainer Gallery card. That is so cool looking. That card is nice looking. And the last one is. Simasir V! There we go, guys! We're finally getting the hits. Finally, the hits are happening. It just took us like 10 packs in a row of nothing good. <laughs> and now we're finally getting the hits. That's awesome. Super awesome. Already, I love this set. This is so much fun. These, these cards are just beautiful. So back-to-back -back packs, like out of two packs, back-to-back, -back, we pulled Charizard V alternate artwork, Houndoom trainer gallery, and a Simisir V. We have hit the gold mine. I haven't sent any out to get graded yet. Uh, I'm still only like a month and a half, maybe two months into uh, collecting. So I'm not really quite to the stage where I want to send any out to get graded, but one of these days if I do have some like crazy ones, I probably will. And honestly, it might be worth it for me to get that Charizard graded. Uh, since that one is a pretty high tier card out of this set, I might have that at some point. But grading is so expensive right now, it's like, what, $100, $150 per card? I don't know if it's worth it to grade cards like this. But there's our Fighting Energy, Clang, Torkoal, Double Turbo Energy, uh, Chimeco, Chimchar. Minchino, Baltoy, Snorunt. We got a Chimchar Reverse and a Tornadus non hollow. I don't even care if we get anything throughout the rest of this box. We got the Charizard. <laughs> That's all that matters. We got the Charizard. There we have another uh, Whimsicott pack. And then the last one for this side is going to be a Shaman pack. Hope there'll be some goods out of these. One, two, three, four to the front. We got Fire Energy, uh, Sigilyph, Acerola's Premonition, Morgrim, Turtwig, Carablast, Beazle, Alucha, Throw, Cleansing Gloves Reverse, and oh, Golden Ultra Ball. <laughs> It's just don't stop. Oh my gosh. You would not believe how hard it is to sleeve over a microphone and webcam. But there it is. The Golden Ultra Ball. Beautiful. <laughs> yeah, you guys are right. We are on fire right now. This box is just getting better and better. This is also a pretty high-end card, I believe. I don't know what the if the value is really super great because it's a it is just like an Ultra Ball trainer card, but I, I know the rarity is pretty high. That's a hard one to get. Oh, it's top ten, bro, bro. <laughs> well, we're on fire then. We've already got the uh, the Ultra Ball and the Charizard Alt Art. Holy, this has been crazy so far. Let me actually hard save this real quick. Let's get this bad boy put in a card saver. Oh, it's really good, Johnny. It's really good. Someone guessed that? Oh, wow. That's amazing. There we go. Ultra Ball Gold Trainer card. Didn't get in the sleeve as well as I'd like, but I'll, I'll probably resleeve it later. All right, final pack of the left side. Can we keep the streak going? The left side started out so slow, but it ended off with a bang with two crazy good cards. 
Ah. One, two, three, four. Psychic Energy, Gloria, Staravia, Berry, Clefairy, Cheruby. Well, that's that's a, quite the chain of rhyming. Sock, Corfish, Gallet, Berry Reverse, and a Empoleon Hollow. You know, all the hollows we've got have actually been good hollows, so at least we're not even getting like basic hollows. Like all these have been decent ones. Still not gonna be worth much because they're just a hollow, but still nice. Still nice to be getting a good Pokemon as our hollows. It was 30. So the gold ball is worth like 30, and then the Charizard you guys said was like 180 or 160. Something like that. I mean, we've pretty much already made the price of the box back, so that's nice. That's really good. Doing way better than we did on Evolving Skies. Evolving Skies completely screwed us over. I got like maybe one or two decent cards and they were still under 10 bucks. This is going much better than Evolving Skies did. We got the Fighting Energy, Clay Doll, Executor, Hunting Gloves, Sneasel, Corefish, Magmar, Spirit Bomb, or Spiritom, Spiritomb, Spirit, Spirit, Spiritomb, Burmy, a Throw Reverse, and finishing off with a Manaphy non hollow. So that is the left side of the box done. Time for the right side. But will it be just as good as the left side? I don't know. We'll see. Get a few of the packs down here. Start out with a Charizard pack. We already got this guy. Now we just need to get the rainbow version of him and I'll be happy. Give us the rainbow Charizard. That would be uh, beautiful. I just thought of something too. Isn't the alternate artwork cards the hardest to pull in the set? If I'm not mistaken, I think the alternate artwork cards are the hardest to pull in the set and we pulled the Charizard one. That, that in itself is crazy. There's the fire energy, pot helmet, executor, friends in Galar, Cub Chew, Shinx, Farfetch'd, Execute, Grimer, Hitmon Top Reverse, and Bosses Orders Hollow. I think this is probably the least valuable hollow we've got so far. Gonna have to make a second stack of cards. These things are stacking up high now. Get into the next pack of the right side of the box. Pack number two of that side. What are we gonna be looking at here? Oh yeah, I hope I hope we do get the RCS VMAX. That'd be awesome. Any of the RCS cards I'd love to pull. I also am really surprised we haven't got more trainer gallery cards. Those are usually a pretty common uh, card to get. So there is a Psychic, Ultra Ball, we got the gold one of you earlier, Tropius, uh, Morgrim, Turtwig, Piplup, Shroomish, Purloin, that's our first Purloin I think, Duskull, ooh, Ariados, there, that's what I'm talking about, there's a Trainer Gallery card, um, is, is this one of the better Trainer Galleries? I don't think so, I think this is one of the, I don't think this is one of the more expensive Trainer Galleries, but that's still cool. Our second trainer gallery card and Wormadam non hollow. Sadly, couldn't double up on that one. But we did get that out of it, which it's still a beautiful card. I think one of the things I really love about this set is just the variety in really nice looking cards, with some of them being like, uh, honestly, pretty easy to get like some of the easier to get like trainer galleries they're still stunning looking cards which I love that they did that with this set oh my gosh this pack got oh actually that's just the artwork <laughs> for a second I thought that it got jacked up again but looks fine here we go let's pull that off flip it around or to the front Got the Steel Energy, 
Collapsed Sadium, Claydol, Acerola's Pre Premonition, Mincino, Beltoy, Snorunt, Nosepass, Dedeen, Friends in Galar Reverse, and... Oh! Ooh, Grand Bull V! Not too bad, another V. That is uh, V number three? Yeah, V number three. Well, V number four if you count the alt art. So yeah, that'd be four Vs so far. We got four Vs, a V star, and two trainer galleries. And that is out of just a little bit over half the box. I would set up something like that, uh, Kyla, but I would have to uh, get a P.O. box first because I'm not going to uh, do it to my own address because I'm pretty sure, wouldn't it show? Or is there a way to do it to where it doesn't actually show my address? If there's a way to get it to where it doesn't show my address, I'd do it for sure. Uh, Water Energy, Hitmon Top, Magma Basin, Fraudant, Bidoof, Electabuzz, Chimeco, Gibble, Trapinch, uh, Beazel, 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 Weasel? I, I, I have no idea how to pronounce the name. I'm assuming it's Beazel. And then on the back. Oh. Oh, oh my gosh. Is that... Wait. Are you kidding me? This is the alt art. Luminion V alt art. What? No way. Oh my... <laughs> okay, so I don't know how many of you, um... Or not alt art, a uh, full art. Is it full, full art? Alt, alt art? I don't know which one's which. I haven't looked too too much into the set I've seen like each of the cards a few times but I haven't actually like memorized which is which this is the full art is this um I know one of these gave uh pokey rev the absolute worst time trying to get was this the card that he spent so much time trying to get or is this the other one I mean either way it's a good card regardless yeah this is a crazy good box Murdoch I'm happy with it this is going great There we go. Our second uh, hard sleeve worthy card. It was the alt art version? Gotcha. I think he got the full art somewhat early on, didn't he? That's wild though. This box has been so crazy good. I am just blown away at how many good cards we pulled today. I still can't believe we got the Charizard. That's just ridiculous. This has been a crazy amazing pack. Let's continue on and see if we can get something to top that, like a Rainbow Charizard. One, two, three, four. We got the Dark Energy, Hitmon Top, Magma Basin. Ooh, wait, hold on. What's going on there? We actually have a printing error. You guys can see that right there. There's like an ink, uh, there's a couple ink smears across it. That's actually cool. I'm going to put that to the side because that's a that's a printing error. Crawdont, Sock, Orfish, Galette, Chimeco, Chimchar, Minchino Reverse, and Wormadam Non-Hollow. The streak had to break at some point. The streak had to break at some point. Honestly, that's crazy how long we went with like good cards back to back to back to back to back. <laughs> Sleeve that? Oh, I will for sure. That one's getting sleeved. Uh, any printing errors, I love to uh, keep because you don't see them every day. I honestly would really love to find like a crimped card because uh, I do think those are really cool. There we have the Grass Energy. Uh, Pachirisu? Pekarisu? I, I actually am not familiar with this Pokemon. Blunder Policy, Luxio, Duskull, Farfetch'd, Execute, Grimer, Sneasel, Spirit Bomb, Reverse, and a Moltres Hollow. That is beautiful looking. That's a good looking Hollow card right there. I was actually hoping we'd get one of the Legendary Birds. I'd love to get some of the, um, I think it's the Full Art Legendary Birds.
Let's get these pushed to the side. All right, guys, we have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten packs left. We have ten packs left to get something crazy good. I mean, we've already, we've already got something crazy good, but to get something else crazy good. How many more hits do you guys think we're going to get? Because we've already had like one, two, three, four. We've had five, we've had six big hits, two trainer gallery cards, and then that one error card. What do you guys think we'll get? How many more? There's another V-Star marker. Uh, hit him on top. Magma Basin. Um, that's that's strange to have it upside down. Ultra Ball. That does not happen too often. Starly. Milsery. Carablast. Clefairy. Cherubi. Weevil Reverse. And a Magmortar Non-Hollow. You guys are thinking three or four? Probably. Probably. On average, you seem to get like... 10 to 15 good cards out of these boxes. Um, I don't know if those numbers are counting the trainer galleries, though. They're probably counting the trainer galleries. Uh, so, honestly, we're doing pretty well, I'd say. On, like, numbers, we're doing pretty well. Yeah, it seems like a lot of you are thinking three or four. Two, because of how good the box has been. It has been a really good box. I'm, I'm happy we finally hit a good box. We've had so many mediocre boxes on the channel. It's nice to finally get a crazy good box. Uh, there's our, I believe that's, okay, let me know guys, is this basic energy or steel energy? I've looked at them a million times, I should know which is which, but for some reason I just can't remember right now, it's escaping my mind. Even though I, like, look at them all day when I'm playing Pokemon Go, <laughs> so, I thought it was steel, okay, so I have been saying the correct thing this whole time then, good. <laughs> so yeah, the steel energy, we got the Ultra Ball, Luxio, Pot Helmet, Trap Inch, Execute, Starly, Shroomish, Piplup, Cheruby Reverse, and a Escavalier, Non-Hollow. Come on, Arceus. Give us your card. That is what we are wanting. If I can get one Arceus card, I don't even care if it's the regular V. I will be officially just happy, and if we get an alt art bird, or full art, whichever one it is, I'll be even happier. If we can get one of those, this will be officially the greatest box ever. There's our V-Star Marker, Cleansing Gloves, Floatzel, Sigilyph, Magmar, Ryolu, Burmy, Staryu, Carablast, ooh, Rapid Strike, Urshifu V! Um, ooh, this is one of the special cards from the Trainer Gallery. I think so, at least. Or at least it's one of the better ones from the Trainer Gallery. Not bad, that's another decent card. And behind it is... Axorus Non-Hollow. Well, we have another sleeve-worthy card, at least. Do you guys know if that's one of the uh, really good ones from the Trainer Gallery? I think this is a better one. It's a good looking card regardless. That is a nice card. I am so happy they decided to go with the trainer gallery cards as a possibility in place of the uh, reverse. It has really made this just like an absolute treat to open up. So much more fun when you know there's like more possibilities for good cards. Oh, we got a Bidoof on front. That is epic. But Doof's just so adorable, he always brings, like, good luck. We got a Water Energy, Sharon's Care, uh, Patkarisu, Kindler, Bidoof, Electabuzz, Halucha, Beazle, there's a Gibble, a Reverse Vibrava, and finish it off with this pack, a Ice Q, Non-Hollow. All right, guys, it's come down to this. Six packs left. What are they going to be? 
Yeah, Mountain Goat Man. Honestly, it's really addicting and fun. I was never really into Pokemon cards growing up, but like after I watched some videos from uh, Max Mofo opening up cards, I just instantly got curious about like all the Pokemon cards and uh, the Pokemon card collecting hobby. And then when I tried it out myself, I instantly fell in love with it. it it's honestly like a lot of fun and you get the rush of like knowing there could be something crazy in here but at the same time you don't know it's uh it's pretty awesome i like it uh clink spear tomb axu impidimp electabuzz reverse that's a cool looking reverse card and a zamazenta v this is one of the least valuable v's i believe i don't think zamazenta is worth much uh but still it's another v From what I've seen, most of the regular Vs are not very valuable in this set at all. But they're still pretty cool. This box has just been crazy though. My gosh. I say this is definitely the best one that we've opened. Your best friend Max. Indeed, Caitlin. <laughs> Indeed. There's the Charizard. The Charizard pack. Give us a Charizard card. Actually, does anybody know? Did we get the Charizard out of a Charizard pack? I didn't actually look. Imagine if that was actually what happened. That would be amazing. One, two, three, four. We got a Grass Energy, Dusclops, Starmie, Cynthia's Ambition, Dedeen, Farfetch'd, Duskull, Grimer, Shinx, a Dedeen Reverse, and... Mothim non hollow. It all comes down to this. Four packs remain. Which one should we open first, guys? Put a uh, number one through four in chat, whichever one you think. I know I don't show the codes because I actually play the uh, online game myself, so. I tend to keep all the codes because I actually play the game on, uh, on their online game. So I do not uh, show the codes. I'm seeing a lot of threes and a lot of fours. I'm going to say it's probably three and then, oh, no, there's more fours coming in. We'll open four and then three. And then it looks like two and then one. So literally just counting down. We are almost at the very end of this box. Can we just like get lucky here and pull something crazy? Rainbow Arceus V-Star, I hope. Can you imagine if we pull a rainbow? We already got two really big hits though with the gold Ultra Ball and the alternate artwork uh, Charizard V, so. Lightning Energy, Acerol's Premonition, Morgrim, Friends in Galar, Cast Form, Throw, Shroomish, Piplup, Turtwig, a Cinchino reverse, and a Dr Dredagon, 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 non hollow. Two packs after this. Can we do it? All right, later, Avery. Thanks for watching, dude. Thank you for watching. Hopefully we do get something good. One, two, three, four. We got the fire energy. We got the cafe master. Monfer That's the first Monferno we've seen, I think. That's cool. That's a nice artwork too. I really like that. Gloria, Baltoy, Snorunt, Nosepass, Milsery, Cub Chew. Ooh, a Dustnor Trainer Gallery card. So that is our fourth Trainer Gallery, I believe. And a du <laughs> Yes. We got Dusknor and Dusknor. Dusknor Hollow, Dusknor Trainer. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, this has been a crazy good box. I'm happy. Uh, no, she's not, G3. 
Uh, she will be in a couple hours, though. It's only 8 o'clock where I am. I would not be talking as loud as I am if she was asleep. We got two, two left. So just two packs remain. Will we get a rainbow in either of them? I'm honestly okay with any rainbow, e even the Whimsicott. It'd be nice to get just a rainbow card in general. But since we already got two crazy big hits, I don't think we will. Uh, there's a Psychic, Luxio, Pot Helmet, Sigilyph, Electabuzz, Alucha, Beazle, Gibble, Trapinch, Nosepass Reverse, and a Breloom Non-Hollow. It all comes down to this final pack. Is this pack the one that will have the Rainbow Charizard? We're about to find out. We're gonna go kind of slow on this final pack. Just gonna savor the moment. Honestly, I really hope we get a Kingler. I'd like to see a Kingler uh, card. I believe there's a Kingler V Max, if I'm not mistaken. I know there's a Kingler V. One, two, three, four. We got our Steel Energy. We got Floatzel. Hunting Gloves. By Brava, Corfish, Gallet, Chimeco, Chimchar, Minchino, a Sock Reverse, and a Lapras Non Hollow. <laughs> well, you can't really complain when you got the pulls that we did today. So, it looks like... Oh, actually, yeah, we actually got three good cards now that I think of it. We got the, uh, Luminion Full Art, the Ultra Ball Gold, and the Charizard V Alternate Artwork. This was by far the, uh, star of the show. That is just a stunning card. But yeah, that's, that's pretty crazy. Yeah, no last pack magic, sadly. And then, uh, on top of that, we got this, uh, little printing error one where it's got some ink on the top like that. And then uh, we also got all of these. We got our Dusknor Trainer Gallery. We got the Zamazenta V. The Rapid Strike Urshifu V from the Trainer Gallery. A Grand Bull V. A Ariados Trainer Gallery card. A Houndoom Trainer Gallery card. A Simiseer V. A Zarud V. And a Whimsicott V Star. This was the only V Star card we got, sadly. But overall, that's a crazy good box. I'm still just blown away at this right here. That is an insane box. Well, that's going to be it for this stream. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, if I can find my mouse, at least. <laughs> it's buried in packs and everything else. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. We will be back uh, tomorrow with another Call of the Wild stream. And uh, yeah, until then, I really appreciate everybody dropping by to watch me open up this box. This has been by far the best box we've ever opened and the most fun to open. Most likely, I will edit this down and put it on my second channel at some point in the future. So we'll see. But anyway, thank you guys for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Peace!